So, I finally watched Alien. Yes, yes, applause, applause, applause. Yes, cheer, cheer, yes, I finally watched it, yes. Suggested to me by actually a bunch of people, like, uh, Green Bear, Tenet Bray 81, Sigourney Girl, like, honey, I get it. I remember in one scene, I was just like, now that's a woman. Pop culture ruined Alien for me. And that's shitty because, like, in the movie, there's a lot of key things that are supposed to be a surprise. I hadn't even seen that movie when I was little, and I knew about it because of other shows, other things, people talking about it. This movie is definitely, like, a genre nostalgic movie. I mean, one of those movies you have to see at its time. And sadly, I feel like, for me, and anyone else who watches it kind of late, kind of misses out on the experience. But the alien in the movie was supposed to be scary, but I've already seen pictures of it growing up. But luckily, I didn't know a lot of the deeper stuff, like uh, the whole Android thing. <laughs> so I was like, ooh, cool, that's something I didn't know. But I will say as well, I thought it was boring. Yeah. Again, that's only because yeah. I knew shit was coming. I knew Ripley was gonna be the only bitch left. I knew there was gonna be a chest burst. I knew there was gonna be like a thing. I knew, I knew, I knew, I knew, I knew. Thank you, pop culture. You kind of took away my experience with this movie, so. <laughs> Chip itself and that creepy heart thing that it did, fucking creepy to me. There was bits that saved it, but in the end, I was like, it was okay. It was beautiful. It was really well done. Experience-wise, I didn't really get much out of it.